Hello everyone. Welcome back to iMyPhone channel. iOS 18 has officially launched. I've already updated and there are so many amazing features. Are you eager to explore them too? In this video, I will show you how to download and install iOS 18 in a straightforward way. Let's go. You can open General, then click Software Update, turn on Automatic Updates, and you will see the iOS 18 update displayed. Turn Update iOS on. iOS 18 update will show on here, but if it doesn't appear, don't worry, keep watching the video. You can give the second method a shot by using a third-party tool, iMyPhone Fixbo, to download iOS 18 with just one click. Step 1. Download Fixbo from description below. Launch it, and connect your iPhone to the computer. Step 2. Under the iOS Upgrade slash Downgrade tab, choose the Upgrade iOS as you want to get the iOS 18. Step 3. Fixbo will automatically detect your device. Once the info shows up, click the Download button to get the iOS 18 firmware. Step 4. Click the Start Upgrade iOS button and put your iPhone into recovery mode. For iPhone 8 and above, instantly click and release the Volume Up key and then the Volume Down key. Press and hold the side button. Until you see this. Wait for a few minutes for the software to finish installing the iOS 18 on your iPhone. After your iPhone restarts, iOS 18 has been successfully downloaded on your device. Amazing, right? Enjoy your iPhone with iOS 18. iOS 18 has rolled out a bunch of cool features that really improve the user experience, bringing everything together for a smoother ride. If you're interested, go ahead and download it to check it out. However, please note that after upgrading to iOS 18, your phone may experience bugs, such as reduced battery life and overheating. Downgrading to iOS 17 is the best choice. In this video, I will show you how to remove iOS 18 without losing any data. As you can see, iOS 18 devices have tons of data. Follow the instructions in this video and all your data will be recovered. After the downgrade, step one, turn off Find My iPhone. Go to your settings and access your account. Next, find the option for Find My and switch it off. This is important to avoid any issues during the backup and downgrade process and to prevent activation lock afterwards. Step 2. Backup your data in iTunes. It's best to use iTunes to backup your data, especially if you've updated to iOS 18. Simply connect your device to your computer. Open iTunes and go to the summary page. Click Backup now to create a local backup. If iTunes doesn't display the summary page for iOS 18, yet check back later. Step 3. Remove iOS 18. Remove iOS 18 with Imiphone Fixbo or iTunes. If you want to downgrade iOS easily with one click, this iOS downgrade tool, Imiphone Fixbo is the one you can't miss. If you want to downgrade with iTunes, it may have to go through a lot of errors. For your convenience, I will first demonstrate how to remove iOS 18 with Imiphone Fixbo. Method 1. Remove iOS 18 with Imiphone Fixbo. Step 1. Download Imiphone Fixbo from the bio in the descriptions below, and launch Fixbo. Step 2. Click the iOS downgrade to downgrade from iOS 18 to iOS 17. Step 3. Connect your iPhone to PC with USB. Follow the on-screen instructions to put your iPhone into recovery mode. For iPhone 8 and above, instantly click and release the volume up key, and then the volume down key. Press and hold the side button until you see this. Step 4 Fixbo will detect your iPhone system and show you the available iOS firmware version to download and downgrade. Click the download button to get the iOS firmware 4. Downgrading when the firmware is downloaded. Click the start downgrade iOS button for Fixbo to begin downgrading your current iOS version to older iOS. In a few minutes, the downgrading process will be complete. Now iOS 18 has been removed from your iPhone. If you don't want to see the second downgrade method, Please click on the timestamps in the description to jump directly to step 4, where you will be shown how to restore your phone's previous data. Method 2. Remove iOS 18 with iTunes. To removing iOS 18 with iTunes, you must search and download the IPSW file manually. Visit Ips Me to find the iOS files for your iPhone model. Download the file and wait for the process to finish. Plug your iPhone into your PC. 
Open iTunes and navigate to your iPhone. Hold the Shift key on your keyboard and press Restore. Select the Restore Ipsu file that you downloaded. Wait for the Restore to complete and the iPhone to reboot. While its operation is similar to any two, it's important to note that some iOS 17.18 users have reported compatibility issues, errors, and potential risks of being. So I recommend you to use Fixbo. Step 4. Modify backup to restore data from iOS 18 to iOS 17. If you backed up your data with iOS 18, and now your iPhone is back to iOS 17.5.1, some modifications are necessary. After the downgrade is complete, you will see your phone has been reset. Now let's start restoring backup data. Click Transfer your apps and data from Mac or PC. Go to the Restore Backup page in iTunes. Hold down the window and our keys to open the Run dialog box. Type in App Data and hit Enter. Navigate to Apple Computer Mobile Sync and open the backup folder. If you can't find the backup file, hold down the Windows and our keys. Type in User Profile and hit Enter. Navigate to Apple and click on Mobile Sync and open the backup folder. The backup we created should be the most recent one, based on the last modified time. Inside the folder, scroll down to the bottom and find the info. Open it in Notepad. Press Ctrl and F to open the search bar and search for the word product. Not too far down you'll see the product version. If you downgrade from iOS 18, it should say 18 and you can change it to iOS 17.5.1 or the version you downgrade it to. Then tap Ctrl and S to save the file. Now we can go back to iTunes and start the restore process. Click on Setup as New iPhone. Click on Restore Backup and select the backup we just modified. iTunes will restore your data your phone will restart. Now you can see that all the data including apps, photos have been restored, and your iPhone is now downgraded to iOS 17. Enjoy your iPhone, and your iPhone has been successfully downgraded, without losing any data. If you want to remove iOS 18 with one click, we highly recommend using Fixbo. Alright that's it for today's video, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, if you found these tips helpful. Feel free to share them with your friends. See you next time.